Good afternoon. A man was shot and killed by police on a New Mexico highway this morning. A man in a stolen car. News 13's Elena Mendoza is live in Clovis where it happened with more. Elena. Kim, the scene is now clear, but many questions still remain unanswered for the father of the man killed. He tells us his son was just 22 years old. Amarillo police broke the news to him earlier this afternoon. Let me know that my son, Aaron Chavez, is the one that passed away. Clovis police won't confirm the name right now, but will tell us one of their officers shot and killed a man just before 12.30 a.m. on the Prince Street overpass near Brady Avenue. A witness who was in the Allsup's parking lot tells us the shooting happened about 20 feet in front of the blue car that appears to have wrecked out on the curb. He says he then heard at least three gunshots. State police were called in to take over the investigation. They do confirm that blue car was stolen. The man's dad is still trying to process what's happened. It's pretty tough for me right now to understand that what I'm going through. Um, it's a parent's worst nightmare to wake up and, and realize that you have to bury your son and everything goes so fast. We spoke to the owner of the blue car. He says he had been helping Chavez out because he was facing some hard times. He says Chavez stole the car early Sunday morning. They had been looking for it since. Kim, back to you. Thanks, Elena. Now, what's unclear is how police caught up with him. State police say they do still have more interviews pending. We're told the officer involved was not hurt.